Okay guys, it's time again for one of my unpacking videos and I do have a couple of, of uh, this in my arsenal but I quite find them clumsy and not as to the quality that I would expect but I already have this one here but it's not removable it's from Ulanzi as you can see I can't even remove this part here so it kind of defeats the purpose in using it on other tripods so I decided to buy one that uh, can be applied to any kind of, of uh, tripod that you have or monopod so basically this is a ball head mini ball head and I ordered a couple of these so I think I have four as you can see there so yeah I'm adjusting the the position of my camera here okay so I ordered four of this and test this QR code and it doesn't really have a name online just a generic uh, type of ball head so I was kind of curious and ordered it so one of the, the cool features that this one has is it has as you can see here I already read the, the the writing or the details of the post of this product here but seeing it in in actuality shows me now the good quality of this product so I'm just gonna add another lighting here just to make sure that you're seeing everything clear so let me light it up a bit so again I'm using white so you'll see the details okay so here we go so as you can see it has this rubber pad here and everything is made out of I think it's kind of an alloy but I feel like it's a steel because of the heft and the weight of this area here it kind of feels like a steel but this one feels like alloy and this one also feels like steel this one you can turn and remove this one if you need to so as you can see you can remove this one which is a good addition because you might be attaching a different adjustable head here but no as you know you can remove that one but one of the great things I noticed that this doesn't have this one this one is not removable it also has a standard attachment here at the bottom screw but the good thing about this is this it has one knob to hold on to everything so now it won't turn and this area here won't turn as well so you just use this knob and when you loosen this up everything turns again everything is moving again and it's pretty tight it doesn't have any clicks so if you soft lock it like so you can still move it and it's still fluid it's still moving the way you would want a ball head to move so I think I can add more grease here for this area here but you see it's moving quite nicely okay so for example I'm gonna use it for this one I'm gonna attach it to this head right here right now for example this is gonna be your tripod and I'm gonna attach it here right so now all you have to do is turn this knob and you can rotate everything and then just position what you want just tight it up and everything is holding up so it's it's a nice kind of uh, mini ball head and it's good quality it doesn't really have a name it's kind of generic it doesn't have a brand on it but i'm trying i will try to find the supplier of this one so that you, you guys know but you would see it in if you, if you search ball heads or mini ball heads you'll see this one offered as an option so yeah this is a good buy and, and if you want to get one for yourselves I'd gladly add a link in the future but I'm trying to search now what this brand actually is named but just to be to show you know that's that's the product number there it's, it's written there 
and yeah I'm just gonna go scan this up this this QR and, and let you know what I find out okay thanks for watching